Hello YouTubers, this is another one of my um, videos and today I'm here to, well, talk about things I just really, and I mean really hate. I don't hate a lot of things, in fact I try not to hate things, but there's some things I just hate. And it's like, and I've got to get it out because I'm really getting annoyed with it. First of all, you, you know who that you are. Your pants halfway off your pant, off your body. Your wife beater t-shirt, your backward cap, and your pale pimply faced skin rapping every Eminem song, every Snoop Dogg song, Ice T song, you know. You think you are the new Slim Shady and you think every lady would want you because you smell like you bathed in a thing of Axe body spray. Well, I have some news for you. Yuck! Oh, I mean, I mean, I'm not judging you. Judge it. I don't like judge people, but I hate it when guys like think they're new. Like, you know that word wiggers. Like, they have like pants halfway off their body, and they wear baggier. Wife feeder shirts, they're so big, and they think they're the new Eminem, and they act like, Yo, what's up, bro? And it's like, um, Yo, girl, wanna go out? No. And you're just like, Ugh. It's just trashy, classless, and yuck. And girls, guys, like, Guys, girls like it when you put your pants up, for goodness sakes, especially when you're 28 years old or almost 30. Grow up. Yuck. I mean, I'm not, like, expecting, you know, guys to be perfect, but at least put your pants up, for goodness sakes. And also, one thing I do not like I've already mentioned this and I've gotten a lot of crap I hate the Kardashians I also am not a big fan of Paris Hilton and I will not watch the real housewives of anything but uh, yeah I just don't like those shows I've never been big in bad girls club I, I tried to watch it but sometimes it's kind of funny um I do admit I do like Jersey Shore and Teen Mom and Jersey Licious. Um, Snooki's funny, but Kim Kardashian's a snob and Paris Hilton's ew. But you really hear don't hear about her except she did a song called um, "Drunk in Text." Is that what it's called? Um, I don't pay attention to her that much. Uh. Another thing I hate, um, are when you go into the dirty bathroom and, like, it's like, public bathrooms are so gross. They have, like, toilet paper and, like, watery stuff. You just don't want to know if, like, somebody had, like, like, there's urine on the floor or something. And, like, you go in a stall and it's covered in, like, tampons, pads, and the f um, toilet is clogged. It's gross. I will not. I, public bathrooms are, like, my last choice. And I think talking about it is making me even feel more nauseated. I'm, I really hate it when, like, guys think they're so macho. And this is a very serious topic, and, like, think it's okay to, like, um, like, 
downgrade their girlfriend by um, verbally abusing them to in front of everyone. Um, it may not be hitting or anything like that, but verbal abuse is just as bad as um, getting slapped. So guys, um, if you want to get in a fight and call your girlfriends all kinds of dirty names in public, um, you're a loser. I've had that happen, and yeah, it's like, yeah, or when couples get in fights in front of you, it's like, okay, this is awkward. I've done it before, so, yeah, uh. I also hate it when like couples get all lovey dovey and coupley and um kiss and like make out and you're like Okay, get a room so keep your fighting and don't make out in front of me because that's disgusting. Public display of affection is gross. It's like get a room. Like, when they're making, I don't care, like, a kiss on the cheek or kiss on the lip, but when you're, like, in a makeout session in front of me in a movie or anywhere, it's disgusting and it's not very classy. Hmm, what else would I hate? Um, I'm not a big fan of, um, shows like, um, Family Guy in South Park and, um, um, can't remember what it show it is, The Simpsons, um, Futurama, I just never been big on adult cartoons, oh, I can think of American Dad, um, I just, they're just, um, I'm not, like, a cartoon person, and I guess, um, it's really supposed to be adult cartoons, but, um, most of the people I watch, uh, who watch it, are about, like, 14, 13, and find, you know, sex jokes and that kind of stuff funny at that age. That's the age where, you know, oh my gosh, South Park Cartman did this, or... Peter did this is around 14, 15, 17, 16, 18. Some adults like it. Some younger kids like it. It's like, your 13-year-old just said something I wouldn't say now. It's like, my brother and yet me. I used to watch him a lot, like, with my brother because we were younger and I was dumber. <laughs> and we, I don't know if. That sounds like I hate it, but it just, you know, we're in good times, but, um, with my younger brother. You know, even though I was watching the really crude cartoons, but it's like, you know, the, it's supposed to be for, like, you know, grown adults, but 14-year-olds and 13-year-olds watch it. And I'm no longer in the cartoon phase. I like Spongebob, though. Um, what else do I hate? I really, really hate ignorance. Like, people who will, like, be really ignorant towards a race or a gender or a sexual orientation or any, like, a handicapped. Um, I really get mad when people say that people with autism are all retarded because that's not true. I, I have a mild form of free of autism and not not retarded um there's a lot of really bright people with autism and saying that they're all retarded is not true and i hate it when people say all african american are ignorant i grew up with a dad who believed that and um, Dad, that's not true. There are plenty of bright, intellectual African Americans. Um, just because you're, I just don't like grouping people. 
just because somebody looks a certain way, acts a certain way, or has a problem does not mean they're all the same. I grew up kind of like that, where people were bigoted, and I don't want to be that way. I mean, everyone's different. We all have different traits. We all think different. We all have different beliefs. And you know what? That's what makes the world so great. So I don't like ignorance. And I don't ever want to sound ignorant. And, you know, everyone lives a different life. Everyone has a different story. Everyone is different. And um, by saying a certain group of people are this way or that way, it's not true. I mean, you could say a lot of things about me that aren't true. You can group me in a bunch of people that are not like me. You can group anyone, and that's wrong. We're all individuals. We're all children of God. Um, another thing that I just really hate that I need to get off my thing, this is my last thing, is hypocrisy. Like, um, everyone has been one at, at once. Like, um, you're, like, saying one thing and you mean the other thing. Like, like, saying, I just don't like hypocrisy. Like, I don't like it when somebody says something and does the exact opposite. It's just not good. I mean... That's it for my rant, because I could go on and on and on. Um, you can PM me, um, comment me, you can disagree with me, and you can even tell me, like, you don't like it. Tell me what you don't, what you hate the most, and maybe we might agree, maybe we might not. And, you know, um, if we do disagree, let's agree like adults and no childlike behavior. Thanks and happy spring!